happy Tuesday and welcome to our 10th episode. Every news station you turn on right now is talking about the war that's happening overseas. In Matthew chapter 24, verse 6, it says, You will hear of wars and rumor of wars, but see to it that you're not alarmed. Such things must happen, but the end is still to come. Some may say this war that's happening is a signal of the end of the earth. They may be true. They may not be true, but what I believe is just because there's battles or conflict does not itself mean the end is near. These real wars are part of God's unfolding plan of the earth. They must take place, but they're not the signal of the end. Nobody knows when the end is near. There's one thing that's for certain is that every day that goes by, we get one step closer to the end. We should not have anxiety though. We should put our faith in Jesus, our relationship in Jesus, because if we do, there's nothing to be anxious for. Pastor John said on Sunday, stand under his wings of his word and his truth. His wings will protect us. Enemies will always be coming for us, but if we can find comfort being under the feathers of his wings. We have wars not just happening overseas, but in our daily life, in our social settings, in our political settings. I say to us all, stop yelling across the aisle at your enemy that doesn't think the same way you do. Your political affiliations do not define you or what you should believe or how you should believe, but put your faith in Jesus. Put your faith in Jesus so that you don't focus on what society or your family or the news station tells you to think. As you find yourself arguing to make a point, take a look at your heart and ask yourself in your relationship with Jesus, what would Jesus do in this situation? Our world has changed. We have allowed society to be our moral compass. We've let party affiliations be our moral compass. However, Jesus is our only moral compass. I pray you have a blessed week. Join us at Legacy Church on Sundays at 11 a.m. Love you all and catch you next Tuesday.